We are going to be running the shrimp and I have got this really cool idea that I want to test all these batteries. SMC high voltage, roaring top, 25C, that's a 75C. This is a Ovonic, that is a 50C. Then this SMC is an 80C and then this Gen's Ace is also a, this is a 45C. So what we're going to do, we're going to run these in succession. We're going to go down from 25, then we will run the 45, then we'll run the 50, we'll run the 75, and then we'll run the 80. So I finally got an old phone to work, to work with the GNSS. So now we've, we've got this ability. Oh yeah, it works, okay. So this is going to go down in here. All right, so we got this all put together. Let's see. All right, we got movement. So let's hit track. Let's hit start. Okay, we'll leave that there. I'm gonna throw this in the water. This is the roaring top. going that way just a smidge there's a duck You can definitely tell that lower C rating has an effect. It's only about half throttle right there. Full trigger. That was a full trigger hit for a while. All right, I'm gonna bring it in. We'll open it up, check the speed, and check the temperature of the roaring top. Oh. Let's go ahead. All right, let's go straight over here and see what we get. All right, so we got movement, okay. Break the damn phone. Let's hit stop. Let's hit read. 68 miles per hour with the turn pin on it with a roaring top uh, 25C. So, not bad. Big difference compared to the SMC. Alright, so let's go ahead and back. How do we, how do, we do that? 68, yeah. Alright, how do we stop? Okay. Good deal. Alright, let's go ahead and open it up and check the temp. Alright, let's see if we get smoke. <laughs> yep, we got smoke. Holy crap. Oh my god, it swole the battery. That is not cool, man. That is not cool. Let's see what the motor temp is. I smell it over here. Yep, 120, 100, it was 134, but yeah. That battery, woo! 186 degrees. 
Wow. That is risky. <laughs> okay, well, that's what we get. Whoa, look at that. She blew out. We're not going to run that anymore. Holy shit, that fucker could have caught on fire. It could have. It could have. Yep. She's scalding hot still. I bet she's 180. All right, well, we're on top 25C. Not enough for the shrimp rigger. We're going to go ahead and take that and just set it over here. Unfortunately, that is what it is. 68 miles an hour. Not really very impressive in my opinion. And she's still kind of hopping. She's still kind of hopping. It's been about 15 minutes. I'm going to go ahead now. We're going to try the Ovonic 50C 2200 pack in here. And I'm going to do it a little bit different so we don't burn anything up. I'm going to do like two passes, bring it here, check the speed, give everything time to cool down, and then we'll run it out again. Just don't want anything crazy going on. Wow, look at that. I'm just noticing now the end bell of my motor has pushed out. That is crazy. Something screwy is going on with this motor. All right, now this run is going to be the Ovonic 50C 2200. Got the GPS in there. Let's go ahead and do track start. Make sure we got motion. Oh, okay, yeah, motion. All right, good deal. All right, let's go ahead and tape this up. All right, let's hope to God we don't burn up another battery. We're going to do two passes and bring it by. And we'll check the speed. No, that battery's worse. The roaring top was actually better than this one. All right, let's bring it back. I'm going to go get the, uh, the phone. We'll see what it says. All right. All right, let's see here. Phone glare. Let's do read. No, that ain't it. We gotta do okay. Stop. Let's see. All right, we got motion. Stop. Read. Seventy-five. Wow. Nice. Huh. That strut adjustment yeah. really helped. Yeah, it wasn't bouncing. Seventy-five. Okay. Good yeah, but job. that battery still ain't as good. It still yeah. ain't as good. There you go. Let's just do a couple laps, drain the battery down, do some half throttle action. It's running a lot smoother with that strut adjustment. Yeah, yeah, it's really got to be neutral strut position. Yep. Whoa, that was a little close to the shore. Every time I take my eyes off of it and put it on the camera, I do something stupid. A couple more passes. All right. Going up your battery. I got you. I'll try to do a bigger oval for you. Okay. We'll bring it in, check the temps, and then we'll look at the picture. All right. Cool. I don't hear any water in it, which is a good sign. Yikes, look at all the grass wrapped. Jesus! It slowed her down about five mile an hour. <laughs> oh, that is sick. 
What a good shot. Okay, Ovonic battery. Let's see what the temps. We're being a little bit more easy with it. So we're at 119 on the motor. Let's pull the GPS out. Typically that's 130. So we're at 125. We're good there. And 137 on the battery probably. Yeah, 138, 140. Yeah, she's a little warm. A little warm. Nothing like SMC so far. SMC batteries really, really are quality. All right, let's get it out of there and check the voltage. All right, well, for the Ovonic 2250C, we're at 3.73. And we've got 130 to 135 degrees. 75 miles an hour, not bad. Now this run here is going to be the Gens Ace 45C, 4S. Well, what I learned is the Gens Ace will not fit. It's just barely, barely, barely too big. Um, it's hitting the boom tube on the bottom and, and the top canopy here. So we're just going to say screw that and run the SMC 2280C pack. So let's go ahead and get it together. It's throttle. Okay, we're good. Good deal. Eleven miles an hour. That's cool. <laughs> now it's not a signal. Got a little bit of a breeze coming into it. I don't know how good that's gonna be for it. We got it. We got it. Come on. All right, let's bring it in. Stop. There it went. Read. Read. 91, baby. <laughs> Holy shit. 91 and blew the damn cooling line I've off. got Steve. Everybody, this is Steve. <laughs> Steve the hydroplane. So we're going to try this on 4S for the first time. Uh, Jen's Ace Pack. I was going to run this in my shrimp, but it won't fit. So I've got a little 30 mil 1.4 pitch on here. So we're going to just drain the battery. First time I've ever ran this little hydro on 4S. We'll see how it works. Okay, let's see. I have another phone with I got the GNSS that. on it if you want to try my Alright, we're good. We're good. We got tracking. We got boat. Let's go ahead and take it out here. First time ever on 4S. Really windy right now. All right, let me adjust. The wind is not our friend right now. Let me bring it by you. It landed it and then it flipped back over. <laughs> All right, so we went and got it. Let's see that we still got motion. All right, yeah, we still got motion. All right, let's do stop. Let's do read. 50. Not bad. 50 in a blower. I was going into the wind though. Because the wind is coming yeah, from okay. this way. Sure. So, no, yeah, uh -huh. yeah, sure. No, really, yeah. it was fine. Oh, you know, the last, I don't know, what, two hours it hadn't been windy? Yep. Wait and then you see the still shot of it upside down. Oh, it goes, yeah. I'll throw that in. Y'all are going to trip when y'all see this picture. All right. We still got some battery juice left in this thing. Everything seems to be all right. Let's make sure my tape's down good. Just got to drain that Gen's Ace pack.
This thing runs great on 4S. I'm only about three quarters throttle right there. Yeah, she's starting to get nose light after you hit about 45, closer to 50. Yeah, she does not like going left. Nope. Uh-oh. I don't know, it might have just caught air. I'll bring it in and make sure I don't have a loose prop or nothing stupid like that. Okay. Alright. Very cool. Alright, let's see what it did that time. Let's do stop. Read. Old phone is a piece. Absolute piece. Do, 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 do. I think what's throwing us off here is he's got a GNSS running too. And I think that's really messing with us. 47 that run. Okay. <laughs> Alright, after that run, 4S for the first time, let's go ahead and see what the inside temperatures are. If we got any smoke. No smoke, that's great. Battery, wow that's cool. Not even hot. 92. Motor's just chilling. 83. ESC, not hot at all, can't even get to it honestly. Okay, not bad, not bad. We'll probably dedicate this 4S pack to this boat. We won't do nothing stupid with it. Let's see what, uh, what kind of battery juice we got left in this thing. Three point nine two, three point nine oh. We still had runtime left, so not bad. Not bad. Really good, really good battery to dedicate to this boat. Still got a little bit of water in it, but I think that's just going to be part part of this boat. Always dealing with little bits of water in it. Yeah, probably about an ounce in the bottom. Cool. All right, I'm going to end it here. Thanks for watching. Little hydro, little bash session. We got a lot to do today. So, hope y'all enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. We'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.